Hey everyone, I'm Lana Taylor and I love animals. Especially the slow and delicious ones. Mm. But what happens when animals bite back? We find out on this week's Around the Web. If you're afraid of getting attacked by an animal, it's best to stay clear of their space. If you don't want to wrestle with sharks, stay out of the water. If you don't want to get mauled by tigers, don't go in the jungle. And... Dangerous oh. part of the act. And the jaws are open! And the head is in! Ah! To avoid getting your face eaten by a crocodile, don't stick your face in the crocodile's mouth. And what was with the terrified screams from the audience? Like, what did you think was going to happen? Moving on from a guy who invited his own attack to a guy who just really didn't see it coming. Ah! Talk about catching a case of the crabs. Am I right, folks? <laughs> yeah, this stuff basically just writes itself. If anyone knows the hazards of dealing with exotic animals, it's the Aussies, who have turned pissing off nature into one of their greatest national exports. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? Oh, yeah, cut it out. I think he wants to get off. Oh, he wants, wants to get off. Here we go again. Make it easy on him, Marty. They are the best of friends. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mate, that ain't the best of friends. Hey, Marty, that ain't made the That was Mario the Monster getting trapped in a kangaroo headlock, having no one to help him. But really, while you're watching that, who are you cheering for? That's it for this week. If you have any footage of Nature Gone Wrong, send it to us before you send it to CNN. I'm Lana Taylor, and have a good night. Or day. Or afternoon. Whatever time it is that you're watching this. Later. <laughs>